how'd he do? George W. Bush debuts his book of portraits, and we match them up against photos of their counterparts. President George W. Bush spent a year creating portraits of veterans who were wounded during his time in office and published a book of the oil paintings. The book of 66 portraits titled Portraits of Courage, a Commander-in-Chief's Tribute to America's Warriors honors Marines, soldiers, sailors and airmen and women who were injured in the line of duty while Bush was in power. The book was released on February 28 and there is an exhibit of the paintings at the George W. Bush Presidential Library and Museum in Dallas. It is Bush's third book he has published since leaving office. The former president's passion for the arts is surprising to some, including his own family. Last year at a CNN town hall, former Governor Jeb Bush said his brother's fondness for painting was was really weird, but added, he's gotten pretty good at it. In the book, Bush wrote about the veterans next to their portraits about how they recovered, both physically and mentally. The stories also highlight their family's role in the veterans' adjustment to civilian life. President Bush took up painting as a hobby in his retirement. Many of the servicemen and women featured in his book have videos featured on the Bush Center YouTube channel. Part of the description of the book on Amazon reads, Our men and women in uniform have faced down enemies, liberated millions, and in doing so showed the true compassion of our nation. Often, they return home with injuries, both visible and invisible that intensify the challenges of transitioning into civilian life. In addition to these burdens, research shows a civilian-military divide. 71% of Americans say they have little understanding of the issues facing veterans, and veterans agree, 84% say that the public has little awareness of the issues facing them and their families. Each painting in this meticulously produced hardcover volume is accompanied by the inspiring story of the veteran depicted written by the president. Readers can see the faces of those who answered the nation's call and learn from their bravery on the battlefield, their journeys to recovery, and the continued leadership and contributions they are making as civilians. It is President Bush's desire that these stories of courage and resilience will honor our men and women in uniform, highlight their family and caregivers who bear the burden of their sacrifice and help Americans understand how we can support our veterans and empower them to succeed, succeed.